Making a model telescope with two lenses attached to a meter ruler is a lovely activity. Here we can see the inverted image through the telescope, much enlarged, and if we move it out the way, we can see a much smaller version where we can just in the distance see the trapeze on the swing frame. To create this, you're going to need two converging or convex lenses, one with a focal length of around 10 centimeters, which is going to be quite thick, and one with a focal length around 40 or 50 centimeters, which is going to be much thinner. To check the exact focal length of your lens, you can make an image of a distant object, such as the outside through a window on a piece of paper, and the distance you are from the piece of paper will be the focal length. So this one is about eight or nine centimeters. And my thinner one, the image is not quite so clear, but I can just see an upside down tree outside of the window, and that's got a focal length of about 37 centimeters. You then want to add together the two focal lengths, in my case, 37 plus about eight, which makes 45, and attach them to the meter ruler about that distance apart. If you don't have nice lens holders like I do, you can use plasticine or blue tack to attach them. And if you have plano convex lenses, which are flat on one side and curved on the other, you want to look through from the flat side. Then you want to position your eye about 10 centimeters behind the thicker, shorter focal length, more curved convex lens and carefully adjust its position until you see a nice, sharp, inverted, enlarged image. Swapping between looking through the telescope and not looking through the telescope makes it really clear that the image is much enlarged. If you're carrying this out with a class, make sure that no one points the telescope to look towards the sun. Having some writing or a book mounted on a wall some distance away for the students to look at can be a nice way for them to see that the image is enlarged and inverted.